Dare to be great. I am fortunate and lucky. Good things are happening to me. Everywhere I look, I see opportunities for me to prosper. Everything is working out better than I expected. Because you dare to be great. I have to tell you, what you think of me is none of my business. And what I think of you is none of your business because it's coming from the mind. It's basically how do we feel about each other. And we, when we know how to trust our feelings, not the emotions, but the feelings that come directly from our own inner guidance, then we always make right choices. i read something to you. When you think that you have lost or failed, then the person tends to exaggerate the experience. If we're honest, we realize that we don't fail all of the time and that in most of these failures, there are positive lessons for growth and opportunity. And when you know that what they think of you is none of your business, instead of trying to change their mind, you then fill your mind with high thoughts because we create through our thoughts. So only think that, that you desire to create. It's good advice. There's a lot of stuff I did that I would never do today because I know it doesn't work. It causes trouble and misery and isn't, it wasn't really dependent on my inner guidance. But then again, if I look at everything that I ever did that I thought I shouldn't or couldn't or wouldn't do, but I did, I found the good in all of those choices. So I was never defeated, even by what appeared to be a big mistake or a big failure. So yes, as I go forward into my future, yes, I've learned the wisdom from the past, and I don't have to repeat those things that I know that don't work, and I don't choose my future based on my past. And that's what most people do, they're just looking in their mind as to what's in, what's possible and actually people never fear the unknown they fear the known happening again because how could you fear what's unknown it's only some monster that's in your mind that you think might happen again and so my advice would be find the good in everything that you've ever experienced even that what you call a mistake or or a terrible thing and get that wisdom make your correction and then as you go forward into the future, trust your inner guidance and your wisdom and also learn how it operates in this realm and understand how your mind works and how your intelligence works. And then you become a mature, you might say, human being. You become a supreme human being because you're aware and you're alert and you're aware of your surroundings and what's going on and the ramifications of your thoughts and your desires and your words and your actions. That's what's most important. So learn from the past, put in the correction, do your studies and your work and your metaphysics and whatever you call it, and then go forth with enthusiasm because you are eternal and you always have an eternal future that you're creating right now.